Okay, today I'm going to show you guys how to get custom orbs on Windows 7. It's a really easy process. It's if you pay attention to what I do and it'll be really quick and easy. First off, you're going to need to download two things. If you already have like the U Universal Theme Patcher or you already installed or you already patched up your files so you can install custom themes, don't click on the first download. Cause that's well all it is but if you do click on the first link the universal theme patcher to get custom themes you might already have it but some people don't so here it is just uh, go down here to download it once you download it uh, where is it okay I don't have it at the current moment but whatever all you do is run as an administrator, click on the one you have, which operating system. It's, there's two options for it. <clears throat> Sorry. There's one that's a 64 bit, and the other one's a 32 bit. The 32 bit should say x86. But yeah. So the other one is a Mediafire link, it's a take ownership option. So let's see what that is. It's a registry file, so it's a registry. Patch up your registry a little bit. So I'm going to right click. And you, as you can tell, it says take ownership. Nobody's has that. No one on Windows 7 has that unless you've patched up your files. So just double click on it. Double click on it again. Oops. So this one's the bottom wants to remove it, the top wants to add it. So just add it, and you'll be good. Okay, now what you need to do is go to start, go to computer, go to Windows 7 or your drive, go to Windows, scroll all the way down until you find your Explorer. Now once you find your Explorer, right click, right click, and then take ownership. Hit your little take ownership, little CMD will pop up really fast and go away, and you have full command over it. Now what you're going to want to do is you're gonna want to go to deviantart.com and do a search for Windows Start Windows 7 Startup Orb. So there's a couple steel orbs for Windows 7. Yeah. You got you just gotta find which ones for your operating system or not operating your system. If it's either 32 bit or 64 bit. If it doesn't say if it's a 32 bit or 64 bit it just says the name like this one Windows 7 Skull Visual Style comes with a Skull Orb I believe let me check yeah it comes with a Skull Orb which is which looks really cool um, that one's for a 32 bit I believe it is yeah this one's a 32 bit yeah so if it's a 64 bit it should say x64 uh, sometimes it might be in the artist's comment but you could just test them out uh, just keep looking around if there's one like this do not download it because these are just images and you don't really want the images so Windows 8 theme for Windows 7 I have this theme but I don't have the star to work because it says right here Windows 8 in Windows 7 for Windows 7 build doesn't really matter about the build I have uh, 7600 but this is right here x86 so I guess that's for the I'll just let this photo I guess this is just for the little orb but yeah it still looks really cool uh, if just go back just look for if it says 64 bit Keep looking around. Let me see if I can find one at 64 bit really fast. Um, ah, right here. It says Funk VS X64 update. So right here. Let's wait for it to load up. I guess this one's for a 64 bit. So Funk VS explore and explore frame you don't really need to patch up your explore frame that's only if you want to 
but I wouldn't really recommend it. So we got that done. So just install it or just download it. No Explorer. Mine has two options. So mine's already in my Windows 7, my Windows files. So just drag it in. Well, first, with your original Explorer, right click and rename it. Name it underscore back black backup explore underscore backup hit continue and just drag in the one you want um which one should I put Let's see I named this one erase to erase it yes oh whatever okay so I want to install the side orb because I'm going to rename it to explorer so now this one's my explorer so I'm going to exit it out right click on an empty space on your taskbar and click start task manager go to processes and go to explorer hit end process do you want to end explorer.exe hit end process then go to application or applications go to new task and type in ex with explorer.exe just type it in and hit ok and there you go you get your new custom orb so yeah that's how you get custom orbs on your windows 7 so yeah that's all for today thanks for watching don't forget to write comment and subscribe and have a happy happy <laughs> happy holidays